The Hornet is a versatile and reliable aircraft. However, it is aging and facing increasing threats from modern adversaries. Therefore, the U.S. Navy is planning to retire the Hornet and replace it with newer and more advanced aircraft. But what are the potential replacement aircraft for the Hornet, and what is the impact of retiring the Hornet on the U.S. Navy and Marine Corps? Stay with us until the end of the video. The F-A-18 Hornet is a twin-engine multi-role combat aircraft that can operate from both land bases and aircraft carriers. It was first introduced in 1983 and has been involved in every major conflict since then, from the Gulf War to the War on Terror. The Hornet can perform a variety of missions such as air superiority, strike, close air support, reconnaissance, and electronic warfare. It can also carry a wide range of weapons, including air-to-air -air missiles, air-to-ground bombs, rockets, and guns. However, the Hornet is not without its flaws. The aircraft is aging and reaching the end of its service life. The average age of the Hornet fleet is over 30 years, and many of them have exceeded their original service life of 6,000 flight hours. This means that they require more maintenance and repairs, which are costly and time-consuming. Moreover, the Hornet faces increasing threats from advanced adversaries, such as China and Russia, who have developed more sophisticated air defense systems and stealth fighters. The Hornet may not be able to survive or compete in a high-end conflict with these rivals. For example, the Hornet cannot supercruise, which means it cannot fly faster than the speed of sound without using afterburners. It also has a lower stealth profile than newer jets, making it more vulnerable to enemy radars and missiles. The retirement of the F-A-18 Hornet is a big loss for the U.S. military. The Hornet is a versatile and reliable aircraft that has been a key part of the Navy's air power for over 40 years. This aircraft can carry a wide range of weapons and sensors, making it a powerful force multiplier, and it has proven its effectiveness and reliability in many operations and scenarios, including Operation Desert Storm, Operation Enduring Freedom, and Operation Iraqi Freedom. So what will replace the F-A-18 Hornet? There have been rumors that the F-A-18 will be replaced by a new aircraft called the F-A-X-X program. The Navy is hoping to have it in service by the mid-2030s, the rumors have not yet been confirmed, but the Navy's request for $1.3 billion in funding for the FAXX is a sign that the Navy is serious about developing the aircraft. However, with the FAXX aircraft program is still in the very early stages of development. The most likely candidate to replace the FA-18 Hornet is the F-35 Lightning II, which is a fifth-generation stealth fighter that can perform multiple roles. The F-35 has many advantages over the Hornet, such as low observable technology, advanced avionics, sensor fusion, networking capabilities, increased range and payload, and reduced maintenance requirements. The F-35 is designed to work with other platforms and systems such as the FA-18EF Super Hornet, which is an improved version of the Hornet that will continue to serve alongside the F-35 until at least 2030. The F-35 is also expected to enhance interoperability and cooperation with allies who operate or plan to operate the F-35, such as Australia, Canada, Japan, South Korea, and the UK. However, replacing the F-A-18 Hornet with the F-35 also poses some challenges. The F-35 costs more than $100 million per unit, compared to about $30 million for the Hornet. The F-35 also requires more infrastructure and support than the Hornet, such as specialized hangars, fuel trucks, and maintenance personnel. Moreover, the F-35 may not be able to perform some of the missions that the Hornet can do well, such as close air support, maritime strike, or electronic warfare. The F-35 may also face some compatibility issues with existing systems or platforms, such as legacy weapons or carriers. The impact of retiring the F-A-18 Hornet on the U.S. Navy and Marine Corps will depend on how well they can transition to the F-35 or other alternatives. The retirement of the Hornet will reduce the number of available aircraft for missions and training, which may affect readiness and capability. The retirement of the Hornet will also affect the personnel who fly or maintain the Hornet, who may have to adapt to new roles or skills. The F-A-18 Hornet is a legendary aircraft that has served the U.S. military and its allies for decades, but as technology and threats evolve, so must the aircraft that defend the skies. The future of the F-A-18 Hornet is uncertain, but its legacy will live on. Thank you for watching this video and don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more content. Subscribe for more content.